Happy holidays everybody, and Tony here with my review of Christian Simmons' Advent Concert African Spirituals with pianist John Parr, which I saw at the Deutsche Oper Berlin. I was really excited to tune into this concert because I wanted to see and hear Christian Simmons' voice in a concert setting, and as I listened to him, I can say that his voice still had that wonderfully expressive, virile, and round tone that I thoroughly enjoy, especially when he sang the following songs. Thus saith the Lord from the Messiah, composed by Georg Friedrich Handel, an African-American spiritual in the form of Sweet Little Jesus Boy, and Stille Nacht slash Silent Night. He also sang a piece of sacred music from Johann Sebastian Bach, which also demonstrated how expressive his voice can be with good material to work with. And he also demonstrated charismatic charm in his rendition of You're a Mean One, Mr. Grinch, from How the Grinch Stole Christmas. While that final piece may not have the basso profondo depth of Thurl Ravenscroft, he was still delightful when he sang that particular song with slickness, ease, handsomeness, and total dashingness, and also a bit of wit to balance out all of those nasty descriptions for the Grinch, thus making Christian Simmons a total charmer all the way through. I would even argue that his number one best moment was his rendition of Thus Saith the Lord from Georg Friedrich Handel's The Messiah. He was able to just let some of the high notes ring with ease. He also had that plaintive quality that can be reflective and full of prayer as well as full of wonder. And the different nuances and colors that he plays with are all there in that particular aria. Speaking of nuances and colors, he also took advantage of them with his rendition of Sweet Little Jesus Boy, an African-American spiritual that I admittedly never heard of before until Mr. Simmons gave it a go, and he was just as fine in that particular spiritual. There was no doubt that Christian Simmons' voice in a concert setting did show that he can sing with a lot of colors, depth, nuances, and a lot of style and beauty to be found. Nevertheless, the only attributes that were holding him back were his continuous problems of throatiness, as well as inverted vibratos and wobbles that seem to be developing in his voice. Which is a shame because Christian Simmons does have a fine voice suitable for basso cantante roles and even bass baritone roles. And I can see a wonderful future for Christian Simmons in a lot of the basso cantante slash bass baritone roles from Don Giovanni to Mephistopheles to Philip II to Sparfocile and even to the Dutchman, and maybe even Hans Sachs and Fasolt. And if he wants to go a few steps further than the likes of Hunding, König Marke, König Heinrich der Vogel, and Landgraf Hermann from Die Valkyrie, Tristan und Isolde, Lohengrin, and Tannhäuser, respectively. If Christian Simmons can overcome his problems with 30 projection as well as 30 singing by singing a lot more pharyngeally, and using a lot more core in his voice to make sure that that throatiness never comes back again, then I'm sure that his bass baritone slash basso cantante voice will bloom a lot more beautifully and a lot more richly, especially with the greater roles to come for this gentleman. Even with the Achilles heel of his throatiness holding him back, that never stopped Christian Simmons for delivering such a wonderfully nuanced and absolutely dashing concert performance tonight. His voice continues to have a lot of potential for great growth to come, especially with that wonderfully dark color of his, as well as how he was able to sing his low notes and high notes. His high notes were sufficiently present, his middle was quite good, and his low notes were sufficiently resonant. And I'm confident that if Christian Simmons gets rid of 30 singing and many of the inhibitions that continue to hold him back, I am darn sure that his voice will continue to bloom, flourish, 
and flow with ease and more virile beauty. And I still have to give him a lot of credit for taking on this Advent concert like a champ. And John Parr's piano playing was also really good. He made sure that he collaborated well with Christian Simmons and he also butrist a fine performance accomplished by Christian Simmons. Overall, Christian Simmons' Advent concert, African American Spirituals, was quite wonderful to listen to. Sure, this Advent concert had one African-American spiritual in the form of Sweet Little Jesus Boy, but Mr. Simmons' choice of repertoire from classics like Silent Night to rarely heard spirituals like Sweet Little Jesus Boy to popular culture hits like You're a Mean One, Mr. Grinch demonstrated just how fine his voice was tonight, and it also highlights the great potential Mr. Simmons continues to possess. If you're also hankering to see the other Advent concerts, by all means, have a go. These 30-minute concerts are available all throughout Advent weekdays from 5 p.m. to 5.30 p.m., so don't miss out on them. And for those of you who caught Christian Simmons' Advent concert, African American Spirituals at the Deutsche Oper Berlin, what'd you think of it? Did you feel that Christian Simmons' bass baritone slash basso cantante voice was appealing to you? What was your most favorite part about his voice, whether it be his low notes or his middle or his high notes? What was a song that you really liked from this program? Was there something that you thoroughly enjoyed and would listen to over and over again? Or did you feel like his voice wasn't really suited to any of these songs? Please comment below and let me know. Well, that's it for my review of Christian Simmons' Advent Concert, African American Spirituals. Tune in tomorrow for my review of the Lieder and Dichter Liederabend with Kieran Carell, Hiyu Moon, and Philip Yekal. So until then, good night everybody and happy holidays!